In this video, we're going to show you how to embed a YouTube video into a Moodle resource page. We'll begin by finding the video that you want to use on YouTube. Scroll down the page to view more options. Click the share link where we'll find the HTML code we'll need for our page. HTML code, don't panic, HTML is the language used to create web pages. YouTube creates this code for you. All you do is copy and paste it. Clicking share gives us more options to choose from. We want our video to show up in the Moodle page, so click the embed option. We could just copy the highlighted snippet of HTML code right now, but let's click the show more option to check to see that our options are set correctly. We'll scroll down the page to find our options. We can set the size of the video as we want it to appear on the page. Click the arrow to the right to select a size. Keep the size of the middle column of your Moodle course in mind as you select a video size. Generally, the smaller widths, which are the first number in the sequence, will work better. Don't worry too much about the size, though. Students can always click the option to view the video in full screen. Scroll down again. Let's take a look at some of the other options available to us. First, make sure the Show Suggested Videos option is unchecked so that kids don't see those thumbnail videos at the end of viewing a video. The next option will include the standard YouTube player control bar. This allows students to skip ahead to certain parts or return back to certain parts and watch them over and over again. I always leave this option checked. The Show Video Title option is certainly not mandatory. It just displays the title of the video at the top of the YouTube screen. I always leave the next option checked just to protect student privacy a bit more, and you never need to use the last option. With our option selected, let's scroll back up the page to see our HTML code now. All we need to do is simply right-click and copy the snippet of code that YouTube has been building for us all the time we've been choosing the options. Now that we have the embed code that we need, Let's head over to our Moodle course to create the Moodle page resource where we can embed this YouTube video. Start by turning on editing. We'll scroll down to the solar system topic where I want to place my page with the video embedded in it. Look for the add an activity or resource link at the bottom of your topic and click it. Scroll down to the resource section and select page. Finally, Click Add to start creating the page resource. Complete the required sections, starting with the page name. The description doesn't show unless you check the option to display it on your course page. I'm not going to use that option in this case, so I'll just type in a very short description. But remember, this is a required field. Scroll down the page a bit more, and now we are ready to enter the content that we want to appear on the page. When I'm done typing my introduction, I'm going to press the Enter key to get down to a blank line. Now we are ready to paste in our HTML code from the YouTube page. However, we can't just paste it into the text editing area or it will end up looking like this. We don't want the code to show, we want the video to show. Moodle has a special place where you're going to paste this HTML code from your YouTube page. Click the HTML editor button, which is the less than and the greater than sign, to open up the HTML editor. Now just right click and select paste or use control V to paste the YouTube code into the page. Click update to save your changes. Now you can see the video in the text editor. Scroll down to the bottom of the page and click Save and Display to admire your work. To watch the video, just click the red play button in the center of each video. That's all there is to it. Using Moodle to share videos with your students is the best way to ensure a safe, distraction-free experience and helps you keep your students on task. 